We live in Western North Carolina. We do have three animals. We have one dog, Bowie, we've had for about 12 years now, and then two cats, Nix and Jet. We really enjoy pretty much anything that is outdoors. Hiking, going for walks with the dog, mountain biking. We're definitely the kinds of people who will go out and find something in the natural world and explore it. And then a lot of times it leads to us digging up articles or something yes. on the internet and learning about, you know, oh wow, now we know all this stuff about squirrels. Yeah, and our friends so. are like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, it's just cool. I am a high school science teacher. This is my ninth year teaching. I very much enjoy my job. I am an environmental risk consultant for a bank. I work from home in a home office, which is actually right across the hall from our future nursery. We always knew we were gonna expand our family. We spent several years trying to get our you know, lives and careers and home in order to kind of provide the best opportunities that we can. And we're just excited to make that leap now, yeah. finally. We always wanted to adopt, mm -hmm. and we always knew that that was in the cards. I was adopted at birth by my two moms. We would definitely have our child know that they're adopted with age-appropriate conversations, you know, as they grow up. Just talking about the process of how our family, you know, got to be a family. For Zach, he's gonna be really good at sharing his love of cooking with our child and also kind of both of us, but definitely Zach's love of nature, be able to share like that joy of discovering something. That's something that we really want to share. I'm really looking forward to seeing Jessica learn with <laughs> our child. We're both lifelong learners, but Jessica's also, you know, just a lifelong science nerd and fantasy nerd, especially. There's only one person I've ever met in the world who will spend time on a weekend organizing their books in an Excel sheet so they can <laughs> classify them based on genre. Jessica provides the structure to, <laughs> to our life. It's and fine. I fully anticipate that going forward as well. I think they're gonna be great parents in the sense that they both are very fun. I don't think they've lost their creativity or the sense to have fun and be creative. It's like, for instance, we play D&D with them sometimes, and I think it's a lot of fun seeing kind of where their brains work or playing any kind of board games with them as well. Their minds are just intelligently fun. They work so well together and they complement each other and they're really hardworking people. They also are just like constantly bettering themselves and they're constantly reaching goals and doing things. So ultimately it kind of seems like why they would be good parents is that they're just good role models. They really want to bring someone else in this world and teach them everything that they've learned and learn with them as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing what our future child has a passion for. Sharing our, you know, nerdy way of living, whether it's love of nature and love of science and exploring. Having someone to raise and go on adventures with is something that we very much look forward to.